This is the face of the problem, an invasive species that biologists and farmers want to eradicate. 18.2. And this is Ground Zero, the headquarters of the state's nutria eradication program. Here, because this is where most of the nutria have been found. Of the almost 700 nutria that have been taken to date, 580 of those animals have been taken in Merced County. Nutria are trapped, then killed. Right now, there are over 1,500 traps set in the areas of concern. They're really um, a, kind of the trifecta of impacts here in California to our, our water conveyance and flood protection, infrastructure, agriculture, and our environment. One nutria can burrow 100 feet long into levees and riverbanks. State money, environmental and agriculture groups have so far paid for the fight. But today was an opportunity for Congressman Josh Harder to see the problem firsthand as he and other area legislators push for federal funding to help in the fight. This isn't a partisan issue. Uh, if you care about the food that we eat, if you care about going to the supermarket and buying almonds, buying milk, then you need to care about what we can do to make sure that agriculture in California continues to be strong. And that requires us to actually eradicate nutria. And controlling nutria is urgent. One female can breed up to 14 babies every four months. It really four is completely months. explosive. So one female can result in up to 200. Well, that's why we got to nip it in the bud. The traps inspected this afternoon were empty. But these wildlife experts know there are plenty left in the area and they hope to get them before the population explodes and expands. In Los Banos, Merced County, Will Hereford, KCRA 3 News.